Alright, you know what? I done changed my mind again. Because, uh, it is the perfect cold start day. Actually, tomorrow it's going to be even colder, but I really don't want to come out and mess with it tomorrow. And as you can see, that door's shining, and that's the only door, I mean, the only dull panel on it, besides this. Yeah. And uh, I took the hood off and took it in the garage to paint that, and just don't have it lined back up right. And actually, today we're going to uh, go ahead and check the consistency on the battery because I did run it completely flat that time. Actually, you know what? Since I have tracked down my electrical gremlin, I know for a fact that it's just my tailgate shiny. <laughs> but as you can see, I got a little detailing work that I got to kind of get the paint off the wood and stuff. And, Get my lenses back in and all that. But anyway, what what happened was I just didn't turn the key back. Get too far at time. That should be good. But yeah, I did run the barrack and completely flat last time. So we're just going to try to start it on just battery power today, no charger. So just to make sure that it's completely off and to show y'all, let's go ahead and take the clips off the battery. Get the charger set on the ground. And we try her. Hope to God that it works. Yeah, it works, but it sure don't smell too good. Anyway, today we put a little bit of good in time. getting right out on one of the wires. There you go. Now we do it again. I think. I'm gonna make sure these are out of the way. And they are. So yeah, now we do it again.
Well, I didn't want it to quit that quick, but whatever. There's that nice little idle. we're gonna start her real quick let some of that crap burn off then we'll leave her alone <laughs> smoke fly away. So we're done. Uh, playing with it with the manifolds off. We're good now. Uh, whenever it cools down, uh, I'll probably get back out here tomorrow and stuff rags in the holes on the driver's side, put the bolts back in the passenger side, and uh, we'll call it even. I'll get the uh, other manifold fixed. We'll put that back on. And uh, then I'll uh, replace all the vacuum lines and hopefully she'll be good until I go ahead and do the restoration. Actually, I'm not even sure now that I thought about it a little bit more if I'm even going to do that because. This one's really in pretty good shape. I mean, all jokes aside and all the crap that I've said about it, it's really one of the better ones. Uh, it's only been a couple of small wrecks. It's nearly rust-free. Um, it's really dark now, so you can't see it. But And I'm freezing my hands off, so I'll catch y'all later.